Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about a free desktop reminder app that you could use called Wise Reminder. So of course you could use your email calendar or the Windows calendar to schedule reminders, uh, but this is a really clean and easy to use interface. So it's something you might want to check out if you like to set reminders all the time. Okay, so once you install it and open it up here, you just have two main sections here, unfinished, uh, which are reminders that have not reminded you yet, and then you have completed for your completed reminders. Okay, so to make a new reminder, just click on new. Let's say, make a video on Rise Reminder, and we'll make this for 225, and save it. Then we'll just wait till 225, which would be any minute now. And there we go. And then you could postpone it if you want. Let's say 10 minutes. Now when we go back, so one thing you're gonna have to keep in mind is it's going to be running down here in your system tray and if you close it, you're not gonna get your reminders. Okay, so this has nine minutes left in the snooze there since we postponed it. All right, let's do another one so you can see how they look and completed. Call this test. Let's try that out. All right, there we go. So if you want to just mark it as done, just click on got it. And now we'll open it up again. Okay, so now, now we have our completed reminders here. So this test here, it's done. You could delete it from the completed, or you could click on modify and recover. You could bring it back up again and then reschedule it for another date and time. So, and you have the options here to repeat the reminder, and then you could set the date for it, and you could change the ringtone as well. And then up on the top here, you just have some help in the form, go to the website, uh, check for updates, and then the run on startup is checked by default, so it'll start with Windows. And then if you want to exit it, you just click on exit, or you could right click on it from here and click on exit. And like I said before, if you exit it, you're not going to see your reminders. So as you can see, it's pretty simple to use. Let's save that. Now you can see we have seven minutes left in this reminder because it's gonna snooze it again. We could check the details or mark it as done if we don't want to get reminded about it. And now it's in our completed. All right, so I will put a link in the description where you could download Wise Reminder and you could try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.